Hey everybody, welcome to the channel Planting Birches. My name is Megan and I'm so glad that you are here. I have tons of things to talk about before we do this grocery haul, so I'll try to talk fast and make it quick, but it's good, so you're gonna wanna hang around. First of all, I'm going grocery shopping. It is, you know, like late month and I like to do a big once a month grocery haul. Sometimes I do a mid month if it's necessary. Sometimes I do this and that. So let's just get a couple things out of the way. First of all, family of seven. I have five children, nine, all the way down to 19 months, nearly 20 months. Where is the time gone? I homeschool. We're home all day every day people and if you have not been keeping up with us a lot has been happening in our house so if you are here just for grocery hauls can i just suggest to you that you pop over to like the last 10 days worth of videos i think there's like i don't know five six videos of um just catching you up with everything that's been going around our house it's been it's been something and for those of you that have been keeping up with those videos it just got a little more intense Yesterday, Marcus, my husband, we've been married 11 years. He's literally been sick two times in our entire marriage, twice ever. Had a 24 hour stomach bug with fever yesterday. And if you can imagine like, wow, that's what he had like for serious. And he had, he was in a bad, bad, bad way. So compound that with everything else that's been going on. And it's just like, man, this is tough stuff. But um, he is feeling tons better now, thankfully. So go check out, you know, all those videos, get some uh, updates on what's been going on with our family because there's been a lot. I don't even have time for it now. Also, I have a friend, her name is Darnisha. She is somewhat new to YouTube and she has a channel called Real Life with Riddy F. We've been connecting a little bit here and there over the last couple of months and she's just been really working on her channel. So I was wondering, would you do me a favor, do her a favor and show some love, pop over to her channel. She does grocery hauls. She does lots of uh, recipes and she's got some really good ones that you will love. I was, uh, I was catching up on her videos the other week and I was feeling so like, wow I just feel so chill and some of you have said that when you watch grocery hauls you feel the same way and I finally have understood like yes I feel that way I was just very chill she was very calming it was so nice to watch my question for you are you a go to bed grocery haul watcher are you a wake up in the morning grocery haul watcher are you like I don't even care what time of day it is I just want to watch it let me know in the comments. I want to know. I want to take this little survey. So if you're a night watcher, you got to watch it before you go to bed. You like to watch it on your lunch break. When do you like to watch videos, YouTube, grocery hauls? Let me know about it. I tend to watch them while I'm doing the dishes or folding laundry. It's very nice and uh, enjoyable to listen to. So pop over to Real Life with Riddy F. I'll put all of her information down in the description box and make sure that when you pop over to her channel and you watch her videos that you let her know that I sent you over there. Now, what's the other thing I wanted to tell you? Oh yeah. Do you guys follow me on Instagram yet? I know some of you don't have Instagram and that makes me so sad only because we can't connect, but totally your choice if you don't want to do it. I get it. But if you have Instagram, will you pop over there? There's two things I want to say about that. One, I do lots of things in the stories and I would love for you to like, you know, keep up with the day in the life with Megan things and I get to know you better and talk to you and hang out as long as you're like connecting with me if you know what I'm saying. So we're doing this fun little challenge. I have almost 90 people that are joining me. We are going to be taking the simple advice of doctors and science for the ages and trying to apply it to our life and doing like a little health challenge. It's not to lose weight. It's not to get crazy, do some sort of crazy fad, unless you think drinking water and eating vegetables is a crazy fad. And in that case, please join us so we can learn that, that is not so crazy. But we're gonna do it incrementally, like every week on Instagram and maybe a little bit here on YouTube. I'm gonna talk about on Fridays what's coming for the week. And then we can just keep each other accountable, encourage each other. It's really easy stuff. I think those little habits, those little things that we do build up over time and then we become superstars, superheroes, super human, right? Probably not, but that's okay. So I would love for you to join us and be a part of the fun. If you're not on Instagram, pop over there, say hi on Planting Birches. That's where I'm at. Make sure that you're keeping up in the stories because that's where we'll be doing a lot of talking. Have I talked fast enough for you? I feel like my mouth is wanting to move faster than my brain or maybe my brain is moving faster than my mouth. I'm not sure which one. 
So anyway, I am popping into one store today. What? One store only. And it's Meyer, and it's my happy place. We're just getting some things to kind of, um, you know, round out the rest of the month. We've had lots going on and we just need a few things here and there. Some of it, is it gonna be super healthy? Probably not. Let's round out this little chit chat with, I'm in central Illinois. I get that question quite a bit. Central Illinois, let's go to Meyer. Let's go shopping. You're gonna shop with me and I'm gonna shop with you and we're gonna buy the stuff. I'm gonna tell you the total. It's gonna be great. It is going to be great. Let's go. Oh, wow, guys, they've changed things a bit. Look at these big sale signs. And then they're putting the prices up high and they've got some new uh, labels going on. A lot happens when you don't go to the grocery store for a few weeks. My goodness. So well, let's get some apples, people. Gala apples, $1.89 a pound. I've been picking out my own because I, when I get the big bag of them, it seems like some of them are not so good and they just don't last as well. I'm only going to grab a couple of these, maybe four total bananas 46 cents a pound so I have periodically Meyer will send me coupons for things that I already buy I think it's because I'm on the app and so they can just see what I buy because I put my numbers in and I get discounts and all this kind of stuff anyway 25 cents off a pound so it's going to be very inexpensive today and I think this fella right here is looking pretty okay by me well I don't know he's got a dinghy on him there we go. That one's looking better. So look at this now. They've changed it to where they have this organic labeled section over here with all the things. Everything used to be by each other and you just had to see that it was labeled and maybe look a little more closely, but now they're separating it out. Did they watch my Harvest Market video and see me talk about that? That must be why. <laughs> I don't think so. So tomato section, they've really changed that too. There's so much open space. Did I not mention that when I was at Hy-Vee doing a walkthrough video? I'm serious. They were watching my videos, you guys. This is really hilarious. Let's get some Roma tomatoes. They are 99 cents a pound. I uh, made some pico de gallo this past week, and then I'm probably gonna do something tasty again with these guys. I'm not quite sure yet. Keep your eye out for these 10 for $10. So this is the first thing I'm buying that's a 10 for 10. When you get any of these 10 for 10s, like the broccoli over there is 10 for 10. It doesn't mean you have to buy 10 of this particular item, but you buy 10 of any of these because it says mix and match. It's all around the store, not just in produce, but every which way. So I'm gonna grab uh, two of these fellas. Red peppers are also part of the 10 for 10, a dollar each. So I'm grabbing two of these guys. Ooh, they're looking nice. Red doesn't always show up very well on my phone, but man, those are looking good. I'm also gonna do the 10 for 10 broccoli. So now I'm just going to do one of them though. Um, I think I have got one at home as well already. Are you keeping track? That's five things. So I need five more things to get one item free. I can do it. Mini avocado six count. They're $4.99 for the bag. I'm gonna grab those. Ezra's been asking for guacamole and I just love eating like half of one with some eggs on some toast with a tomato, something like that. It's very, very good. Look at these pretty green onions. 89 cents for a bunch of them and I'm going to do it. Strawberries are $2.69. They don't necessarily look the greatest, although I saw this one and I thought it looked pretty good. Let's just check the bottom. All right, those look good. Nice and dark, nice and good, not wet, so they're gonna last. I like it. I told you guys the last time that my kids have really been enjoying salad and they're not as much a fan of the dark green, although those have a lot of good nutrients in them. So we're going to start them out easy. Uh, I like them actually when they've got some other stuff in them, like the carrots and the radishes, but they don't have those in the big bag. So we're going to have to make do and add our own goodness to this guy. $4.99 for this big old bag. Wow, that has jumped up a lot, a lot of monies. So it used to be $1.98 for forever and a day, then it went up to two something, and now it's up to $3.29. Oh, that's painful. It doesn't look very good in the camera, so don't, uh, don't worry. It's not how it is in real life, but we don't need a whole lot, so I'm just gonna get one of the smaller containers. I think I'm gonna go for this one, $13.75 for this guy. Well, these two little breads here must have been waiting for me. They're the only two. This is a split top white for $1.79. Steamable corn from the Meyer, 79 cents. Oh, look at this. 
the kids have been asking to do s'mores and here they are. So we'll grab Hershey's, which is $5.39. I'll grab a thing of marshmallows for $1.99. Although I might go look for uh, Meyer brand because that's gonna be a whole lot cheaper. And I'm gonna grab the Meyer graham crackers for $2.29. We actually like the Meyer graham crackers better than the original. Aldi has good ones too, but we're not going to Aldi. Oh yeah, Edie's chocolate on sale, $2.99. Grab it. Oh, one bag of blow pops left for twenty. Nope, those are dum-dums. For, th there's no price. There's no price. Okay, here it is, way over here for three twenty-nine. There's still nothing there, but we'll take it. A request has been made for barbecue Pringles for $1.59. Oh, nope, that's flaming hot. There it is, two forty-nine. dollars Here's where I get crazy. So I've had a request as well for these Cheeto Puffs. The request has been in for months, but I haven't bought them. And I'm seeing here that Meyer has one and they're in the 10 for 10, which would get us that much closer to our uh, one thing free. And I just, do I get crazy and try the store brand? For a dollar, you can't go wrong. Let's just try it and hopefully it doesn't disappoint. We also needed some Wavy Lays 409. There is a sale here, two for six dollars, but I really don't need two of them, you guys. And I have to buy two in order to get the deal. And I'm, it's a no deal, it's a no deal. We're getting close to the weekend, which means the kids get to pick out some crazy cereals. And uh, Cookie Crisps, it is for one of them, 449. The other request was Tricks are for Kids, and it is for 29. Two for seven, yes, I could technically be saving, but I don't wanna buy two, I just want one. Because guess what, when you buy two, you eat two, and I don't want them eating two. We're not going to Walmart today where I would get my huge box of popcorn, so we're gonna go for the Orville Redenbacher's Tender White for $4.99, six bags, which is just bleh, but I actually need two of them to make it through the rest of the month. Ugh. A couple more crackers to add to the cabinet. 419 for the clubhouse cracker family size. Orange juice time, 309 for the pulp free. A little congested down by the olives. So Lindsay crafted and they were $2.99. I do have a coupon, so I'm really excited about that. If I get two of them, I think I get a dollar off. Hey. I have to make brownies, of course. And uh, I don't know, dark chocolate, double chocolate. Dark chocolate. Yeah, $2.99 for the Ghirardelli. I love Ghirardelli, but you know what? Really, I have no problem with any kind of uh, brownie. They're all really tasty. I just saw these Reese's Peanut Butter Cup and Chocolate. How many of you have made that one before? How's it taste? Is it any good? Let me know. I haven't seen these before. Cookie dough cookie kit. So you get the cookie mix, the cookie dough frosting, and the sprinkles. Well, that would be a ton of fun to do with your kids or your grandkids or just for yourself, really. There's no shame. No shame at all. Huh, fun. Oh my word, I was going to get more of this mix and then I crossed off my list because do you guys remember the price last time? It was like eight something and it's back down to $5.99. Oh my word, I'm so excited. Okay, I'm gonna buy two of them. We love making the pancake recipe on the back. It is delightful, absolutely delightful. Two of these babies. I had to do some serious tag reading. Okay, so for the name brand, 16, ounce can, 16 ounces of marshmallows, it's $1.99. Save some money for the same amount, but for $1.49, 50 cents cheaper. Wet or spotty dishes, why yes, I have been having that. So I'm gonna uh, get some Jet Dry Rinse Aid to put in the dishwasher, and I think I'm gonna go for this one for six fifty seven. There is a smaller one, but I definitely know I'm gonna be needing it. So let's go for this guy. If you guys remember last time, Aldi was out of the freezer bags and these are the quart size for $3.99. I like to have these around. And so I ran out of them and I'm just gonna grab the Meyer brand because I'm not going to Aldi today. Meyer milk 309, I'm gonna get 2%. I'm gonna grab two of these guys and then I also need to grab two of the uh, lactose free ones. Thankfully, they still have the Meyer brand here because there's a lot of things missing, you know? $2.99 for the Meyer brand of the lactose free milk. I'm grabbing two. What are these? Have you guys seen this before? How many of you like cottage cheese for one? I love just putting, putting garlic salt or garlic powder on it and eating it with crackers. It's kind of weird, but I know some people like to put peaches in their cottage cheese or um, looks like some people like to do 
pineapple, if you can see that. But I have never seen this with strawberries or blueberries. What? Here's one with pineapple on the bottom. What's this one? Regular. Strawberry. Okay, so this is a thing. How many of you do this thing? Tell me about it. Looky there, another 10 for 10. It's sour cream time. I just need one of the little ones. Look at this happy day. So these are on sale. Challenge butter, which we really like. I'm going to grab four of them. They're $3.59 each. I also got a little coupon from Meyer for them. So I'm not sure how that's going to work out with the sale and the coupon. Because I think the coupon says you get one thing. Pick it. So we'll see what happens at the register. But I've got me uh, four of these guys. Here's another new thing I've never seen before. So this is the challenge butter, although I'm wondering, is it butter or made? It's a snack spread made with real butter. This one has buffalo sauce, everything seasoning, and oh, chocolate. What would you put that on? Like a toast? Kind of like Nutella? Okay. Wow, I've never seen those before. They look very exciting though. Okay, so you guys remember we talked about this whole health challenge. The first thing that we're doing is water. So do not, under any circumstance, go to the store and buy yourself another reusable water bottle when you have 50,000 of them at home. Promise me you won't do it, but let's try to work on some water. So I'm going to actually grab some sparkling water because that kind of helps me get over the edge and uh, like gets me going in my water world and making sure that I'm drinking enough water. So I'm going to grab some ice mountain, but if you want to join this little, you know, fun health challenge that we're doing, water is our first thing. And we're not starting out with like 80,000 gallons of water a day because that's just not even realistic. We're starting with little increments every day to get us to where we're drinking water, we're making really good water choices. And I don't like adding a bunch of stuff into the water unless it's like fresh stuff, maybe cucumbers, you can put some fruit in there. Have you ever tried putting red delicious apples in there cut up just a couple slices it's divine you can do lemons oranges grapefruit you can put strawberries with mint raspberries with mint you can put cucumbers you can just drink it plain old plain old but i'm also going to have a couple of uh, sparkling waters on hand just to keep me motivated you know what i'm saying all right so back to the groceries i'm gonna get a couple black cherry a couple triple berry they are a dollar nine look i know these are beautiful look at those cups they're so springy and summery don't buy them. You don't need them. You already have 50 at home, right? Now, if you need one because you don't have one and it would really help you, then buy it. But don't buy it unless you really need it. You promise? Don't do it. Just walk away. I am super excited that they have these little veggie trays. I want to do some veggie and fruit stuff, make it easy, put it in the fridge. And uh, I wanted to see them in person. I was going to order some off Amazon, but then I just never felt convinced that I was going to like it. So these are pretty simple. They're white and they are $10.99 each. I may come back one time and get like one for dry goods, you know, like snack type things that you would keep in the cabinet. We shall see. I just don't wanna spend 30 something dollars on serving trays today. So maybe another day. Look at me, don't do it. Look away, look away. Aren't they beautiful though? Oh. I'm in the middle of so many home projects, you guys, and I'm excited about it, but like I said earlier, we've had a lot going on, so this next week I'm really able to work on those things, and some of them are kind of time sensitive, so I need to get on it. Uh, one of the things is doing a carpet cleaning, so I have two rooms that I need to clean. I have a little bit at home already, but I don't want to run out and then only have half of the room done. One of them is a rather large room, the other one's a lot smaller, but I would feel better getting an extra one. So $22.99 for this guy. And I am not a huge fan of like extra scented things, but I will tell you that this one actually is quite lovely. So if you're not super into scented things either, but you maybe you don't have other options, this is a good one. Looky here. So 10 for 10 on the toothpaste and the kids needed another one. I'm actually gonna grab two. With uh, four kids using this particular one, it goes fast. I have a different one for the baby, but let's get that too. We use Band-Aids like it's water. So um, there's a deal, buy $12 worth, get $3 off, which means if I buy four boxes, then I get $3 off instantly, pretty much saving like pretty much getting one box for free essentially so I think that's a pretty good deal although I'm gonna stay away from this one it only has 15 band-aids in it we're gonna stick with the 20 packs I grabbed two of those one of these one more bada bing bada bacon folks 
Yikes, you guys, look at that. It is getting dark and I feel little spits of rain here and there. So let's get this done really fast. Okay, you guys wanna know how much I spent at Meyer today? I'm so glad I went to one store. I love saving money and I love going to multiple stores because it really does save me the most. Sometimes it's nice to just have one store, you know what I'm saying? Um, okay, so my total today was 216.10. So remember I got that floor cleaner and I got those two veggie trays, which, you know, really add up over time. But my total savings was 23.56. So that was the M perks. That's like the app that Meyer has where you can click on some buttons if you want to use their little like in-app coupons, which are great. And then there were specials just around the store, $14.61 I saved there. And then because of the coupons that Meyer sent me, because they're just so great, I saved uh, five. Get it, get it, get it. Because Meyer sent me those coupons, um, I saved $5.95 there. So I'm not a coupon person, people. I do not look for coupons. When there are coupons that print out at the register, I just throw them in my wallet. And if I happen to remember, then I use them. And if they send them to me in the mail, and of course it's already for things that I buy, I just put it in my wallet and head to the store and hope for the best. So that's my story and I'm sticking to it. Will you pop over to Instagram and join me, please? Planting birches. It would be a lot of fun. I would love to, you know, keep you accountable. You keep me accountable. We keep each other accountable. Have some fun over there. And um, if you're not on Instagram, don't worry. We'll still do stuff here on the old YouTube and I would be happy to connect with you here. So let me know in the comments, when do you like to watch your YouTube videos? Let me know in the comments. If you want to come along on this little journey of uh, making some good healthy habits. And um, I will talk to you very, very soon. Thanks for hanging out with me, guys. Bye. Oh, yikes. It is getting darker by the second. <laughs> I bet it's going to start raining the second I get home.